Hey guys, welcome back again. So in this video, we'll be talking about the best free SEO tools which you can use for your content marketing, your blogging SEO and for your digital marketing journey. And the good thing about this is you don't have to go anywhere. Everything has been integrated with my website bloggingos.com and 100% free without login, without solving any captcha. What are this tool? How this tool can help you to find out where exactly your keyword is ranking what is the technical SEO score of your website and what is the domain authority, page authority, how many backlinks you have created and many more than 70 plus different tools have been integrated and this will help you to make your blogging journey very easier. So guys, if you're new to this channel and looking for such kind of awesome videos in the future as well, make sure you subscribe to this channel, hit to the bell icon so you will not miss any future video. Without wasting time, let's go to the screen and I will quickly go through all those tools and will give you a brief summary. What are those tools and how you can use that tool? So here we are on the screen. First of all, guys, what you have to do is you have to visit to the bloggingos.com. This is my website. On this particular website, I have integrated with the name of SEO tools. If you will click to the SEO tools, you will be landed on this particular page. This page has been added with more than 70 plus different SEO tool to make your blogging journey very easier. Well, I'm not going to uh, detail about each and every tool, but I will give you the most brief introduction about all the tools so that you can use them the way you want. Okay, and I will give you a couple of demo demos as well. So these are the most popular tool which will help you to check your algorithm checker, will help you to check what is the technical score of your website, will help you to detect what is the theme plugins you are using or anybody else is using on their website as well as grammar checker and everything. These are the most awesome tool will help you to find out various different keyword suggestions along with where exactly your keyword is ranking in Google. Most awesome tool. Then if you will scroll down guys, you must be having a certain tool about the backlink. So once you will click to any of this tool, you will have a brief summary what this tool and how you have to use it. So I'm not going to detail in each and every tool, but there you can see guys, this is a technical SEO tool. So if you wanted to create a sitemap or you wanted to create one this wow file or you wanted to redirect your website from non WW to WW or vice versa, the kind of code you need, you can generate from here. The most important part, what is the website speed? How much is the website uh, loading speed? Mobile friendly or not? Everything you can track from here. Now you don't even have to log into the Moz. You can check your domain authority and page authority using this tool, which is directly connecting with the Moz. You don't have to log in Moz. You don't have to create account. So this way, guys, I have created this awesome free SEO tool. You can use multiple times, unlimited use without logging, without solving any capture. This is a brief intro guys and I'm, I have been implementing or improving this tool day by day based on the feedback I'm getting. So let's start with the most popular tool which is the website SEO audit. So what this tool is, you know guys, your website can have a different technical SEO issues. So what are the technical SEO issues your website has? If you wanted to see, come to this tool, This I have given already brief introduction about it. You just have to provide your domain name, simply click to the submit. Now what happened is, Actually this tool, uh, once you will be landed on this page, this will start scanning your website starting from 0% and will give you certain technical score. So it is checking almost all the factors started with this one. So first, what about the title tag of your website? So this is how your website is having a title tag which is having a 55 character. So if there is a green tick, that means you don't have any issue with that. Why? Because there is a suggestion icon as well. If you will click to this one, this will actually give you detail what must be the maximum character allowed in Google. So as soon as this will be finished, you should be able to click this one and this will start giving you the suggestion. This is a meta description. What are the keyword you have used? What are the headlines? How your website is looking into the Google? So if you wanted to do any changes with this, you can do that. What are the keywords for which your home page is ranking? What exactly your website inbound and outbound link you can see here? What are the links you have connected? Which are the links which are do follow or no follow? You can get a complete detailed report. Do you have a sitemap or not? If yes, then what is the sitemap URL? So all the different technical SEO factor which are must needed for Google ranking will be judged here and you will be given a complete stat. And if you will scroll down, you will see at the bottom how much traffic you are getting from which country as well. So it is still checking and as soon as it will finish, you will be having a complete report 
at the moment guys i haven't enabled the pdf download option but very soon you must be having a pdf download option so you can download this report what is the estimate worth from which country this particular website is getting traffic so now it has been completed and that's why guys you can see the technical SEO score is 75 percent if it is more than 70 percent that means your site is good doing great okay now if you wanted to see what is the issue with this simply you click to this question icon this will give you an idea your character length must be between 10 to 70 and my i have a 55 so that means there is no issue and there is a sign for grinting but there you can see guys there is a cross that means this requires certain improvement so what are the improvement if you will click to this one this will give you complete summary so you can do the fixes so in this way guys this is the first most important tool you can use for your website as you audit if you wanted to update you can update it whenever you are done with the fixes if you wanted to download this as a pdf this option will be very soon enabled so without login you should be able to download it i'm working upon it so guys your feedback are most welcome now let's go to the palgrism checker this is an awesome tool and this tool will give you a complete idea let's see if i have selected one particular post in the google okay and i'm just copy pasting that content on my website now if you have done any sort of mistake and if you wanted to see whether the content you have used within your content let's say i have copy pasted this content okay and at the moment if you will click to this check palgrism or you can directly import via link and if you will click to this check palgrism it will check the complete plagiarism of your website and will give you the score whether the content is unique or not and at the moment 75 percent content is pal palgrism that means it is matching with certain source so what is the source if you will open this particular post i have copy pasted this particular paragraph from here to palgrism and that's why it is giving us 75 percent so if your score is more than 30 40 percent that means you have to you don't have to use that content and it will give you complete idea which content is matching with the already internet published content and the best part is guys it actually scrapping the google okay behind of this tool there are cert more than 30 40 apis are connected which actually use google data directly connecting with google api and that's why this tool is most powerful to help you understand whether your content is plagiarized or not okay let's go to the next tool guys this is a wordpress theme detector many of you are asking me which theme i'm using what plugin i'm using you can come here you can type whatever blog or site you love and then just check it on that particular blog or site how much or what kind of theme they are using how many plugin they have used what type of plugin they have used this tool will get you all the detail so my this site bloggingos.com is using generate press theme along with that i have all this plugin which i'm using on my website such as thrive architect is the page builder i'm using easy table of content which i'm using to create the table of content header footer element these are the plugins which i'm using to add this certain code on header and footer so in this way guys you will be having a complete list of any website whatever you love now guys let's come to this keyword position checker which is awesome tool what this tool does is it will give you complete idea where exactly any particular website is ranking in google for a particular keyword so here for an example guys what i've done is i have just taken this two keyword i'm putting it here i have checked this i have selected this particular domain so now what what happened is for this two keyword where this particular website is ranking in google that's what the state it will give us okay so you just have to provide up to uh, 20 or 50 keyword okay that is a certain limit then you have to choose your google.com so basically it will check into the google.com very soon you will be having an option for google.in as well i'm adding certain ips as well so you can also check the google.in results so now if you will click to this particular one within a 30 second this will give you complete idea for this keyword where that website is ranking and the best part is guys if i will go to google and search for this keyword so there you can see this is the keyword i've searched here noise cancelling earmuff and for that the soundproofidea.com is ranking at number two and that is what the tool is giving us now let's check for this best best one okay and let's see where exactly that particular site is ranking so what i will do is let's go to the google and this time let's search for the best and search it enter now as i entered it again this is number one and this is number two so again for this keyword soundproofidea.com is ranking at number two position so in this way guys if this particular keyword that site is ranking in yahoo as well you will get that detail and from that a drop down you can choose whether you wanted to check within top 50 top 100 so in this way guys you can tool this you can use this tool with its max capacity okay you can come back to this home if you wanted to read the blog go to the learn blogging you will come back to the bloggingvoice.com home website there you will be having all the list of posts you can read it and whatever you wanted okay so i'm coming back to this particular tool and now let's go to this long tail keyword suggestion tool so what does what does this two, two tool does is actually it will help you to give you complete different keyword suggestions 
So right now I'm here inside of this tool and the name of this tool is long tail keyword suggestion. This is an awesome tool. Let's say you are writing a blog, which is more about uh, uh, affiliate marketing. Okay. So affiliate marketing. Okay. Now you wanted to find out certain keyword ideas around this keyword. So you can use those keyword within your content. So how you can get this idea, either you can go to the Google and surf and search and get that detail. Okay. But in this tool, what you can do is you have to type this one suggest where exactly uh, from where exactly you are getting this suggestion. So Google, then after you can choose your language and English, come here and choose all possible combination and suffix. So now what happened is it will give you the complete questions, prepositions, alphabet, everything, just taking this keyword in the beginning and add all the suggestions at the back end. Click to the start. Now this tool will start giving you all the suggestions one by one, and this will not stop until you will click to the stop button. So there you can see guys. Now you can use this keyword affiliate marketing programs, affiliate marketing, meaning affiliate marketing for beginner. So these are the keyword people are searching in the Google. Now what you have to do is if you're writing a content about the affiliate marketing, just pull this and start including this into your content. Okay. So if you will click to the start, it will keep giving you more and more suggestions. So as of now you are at one of one page, this is one of three. So you can go, go on, go on, go on. It will give you multiple suggestions until you will click to the stop. As you will click to the stop, now you'll be having a complete list. If you wanted to export, click, simply click to the export. You can get that list into this particular Excel sheet. Now you can use or you can share this list with your, all the people, whoever is looking for, uh, whoever is writing content for you. So now you must be having all the LSI keyword in your content. So in this way, guys, you don't have to go to the Google using this simple tool. You must be having a complete list. Okay. Let's go to the another tool in this way, guys, you must be having a more than 70 plus tool. Okay. And if you wanted to see a backlink analyzer, so you just click to this particular one, what it does is it will give you complete do follow and no follow how many link you have created for this post. So you can check for your blog domain. You can check for a blog post. So simply provide your domain. Then after you can see here, there are total 70 links, this many internal, this many external link for that particular domain. So these are the do follow link. Then we, you must be having all the external link which are going outside from your website. In this way, guys, you must be having a complete list. You can download, you can remove or add any of the link, whatever you want it to be with your website. You can come back to the home page. Now you wanted to see what is the domain authority and page authority of your website. We just scroll down, guys. There is a tool with the name of uh, DAPA checker and that actually connected with the, what I should say, uh, this, this tool is actually connected with the more. So if I wanted to see just provide your domain name, simply click to the submit. Now what happened is this tool will go to the Moz and actually there are back at the back end, there are Moz API are connected. So now what happened is as you provide your domain, this tool will go and connect with the Moz API and will try to extract the data and will display here. So this is the page authority. This is domain authority of this domain according to the Moz. So now you don't have to log into the Moz. Simply you can use this tool to get this detail over here without logging without solving captcha this is unlimited use. So this is how guys this tool can help you. You can access this tool right now. I will provide the link in the description. You can visit to the blogging spread this as much as possible, share this tool with multiple people and provide me the suggestions because I'm building certain other tool such as let's take an example. Once you will be entering certain keywords, so it will try to fetch the detail from the Google AdWord, Google trend, question hub and also try to find out the keyword difficulty from certain tools so that you must be having a complete tool within this particular dashboard. So you don't have to go and log in anywhere to get that tool on and you don't have to pay anything to anywhere. Okay. So this is how this tool will work. And I hope this tool will help you in your blogging journey as well as your content marketing journey. So I hope guys you love this tool. If this is so make sure you share this tool as much as possible and share your opinion in the comment box. This tool I have invested more than $500 to make this tool investing a lot to make this little bit more pro or advanced to solve all other problems. So this is how this tool has been. And if this is so make sure if you love this, if you like this video, make sure you like it, subscribe the channel and share this as much as possible. That's all for today. See you in the future video. Thank you very much for watching this one.